Translation, let me see those who have come here to fight, wishing to please the evil-minded son of Dhritarashtra. Dhritarashtra se budbuddhi. Budbuddhi, to use your other's property, is budbuddhi. <coughs> Mischievous. Why one should encroach upon other's property? That is not good. Tena tatena bhundi tha. Na guda kasya chinta na. This is the basic instruction that you accept only what is given to you. Don't encroach upon others' power. This is peaceful. Everything belongs to Krishna. So, whatever Krishna gives you as prasadam, as his favor, you accept it and be satisfied. This is the basic principle of peace in the world. Oh. But because people are not educated in that way, everyone is wanting more and more and more. There is no satisfaction. So that is the buddhi. <coughs> the Vedic culture is that you be satisfied with your position. There is no question of starving in any position of life. People are trying to make economic development. But according to Shastra, it is not possible to develop your economic position simply by endeavor. You are destined to have some portion uh, mixed up with happiness and distress. That is the nature. Uh, dharmatha kama moksha uh, these are four principles of human activities. First beginning is dharma. Dharma means to uh, abide by the orders of the Supreme. That is dharma. The people do not know who is the Supreme and what is his order. So what kind of religion? They take dharma as religion. Uh, faith, a superfluous faith only, but that is not dharma, really. Dharma means to abide by the orders of the Supreme. Dharma Dushakshad Bhagavat Pranitam. That is the meaning of dharma. Obedience to God. There is no conception of God and what to speak of obedience. But this is the simple meaning of religion. Obedience to God, that's three words. Thank you.